Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on making a ribbon shoelace. Um, I've been looking for one and it's needed today. I went to Walmart, Target, and couldn't find it. So finally I went on YouTube and said forget it, I'm going to make it. This is DIY fun of course. Um, so this is what I found on YouTube after, you know, clicking on a few videos. Saw the one that I liked the most. This one was real simple. Piece of tape. Like I said, the one on your desk that you use for work is also capable of doing this job. So because I want the aglet to be this long, I just cut the tape this long and then I leave a little bit at the top here. I'm gonna place it right on the edge of where the tape ends over here. And then fold this little bit over the top, just a little bit, not a lot. Not a lot at all. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold the portion that has the ribbon on it in half, like so. And I just rub my nails to score it, help it stay together better once we start rolling. Okay, now what you're gonna do is you're going to roll as small as you can. Sorry, I just hit my stand, the camera started shaking. <laughs> Alright, you're gonna roll it as small as you can. It is very difficult with nails. Uh, the first one was quite easy. Second one gave me a little bit of trouble and this is the third one I'm doing here. This one is still giving me a little bit of trouble to roll it. But I'm gonna force it to get as small as possible. And keep rolling it. Keep rolling it until it gets to the tape because the tape is gonna stick. That'll be the end of our troubles rolling. Alright. Now all you're gonna do is wrap the remainder of the tape around, going until you get to the end. And wherever the end of the tape is, just rub it a little bit harder just to get to stick properly. Now this extra piece here that we have, all we're gonna do is we're gonna cut it off. Okay? Don't need it. You could also put a rhinestone at the end if you want, or put a dab of glue. But this is it. This is your shoelace, guys. And if you wanted the aglet to be a little bit shorter, you can just cut it wherever you need it to be. Easy, right? Comment below, let me know what you think. And also, if you've tried this, tell me how to work out. <laughs> so you got to see right here where it looks like the tape wants to lift up. How I work that is I actually used my glue gun, the heat from the glue gun, and I rubbed it on that area. And after that, it's not gonna get it, it's not gonna wanna lift up again. Got it, see? 